Welcome back, everybody, to the Bounty Mode run of Parasite Eve 2. I am your host, Alexander Frost, and this is Episode 11. And now, when last we left off, I asked all of you to help me decide if I should upgrade Necrosis or leave it as is. Well, the thing is, I got two votes that said, go on ahead and bump it up. Technically, it was only one. The other vote was, leave it as is, but if you're going to get the... If you're going to get Apobiosis anyways, go ahead and upgrade it. So I'm going to count it as an upgrade vote. And then the other two said, leave it as it is, which leaves me as the tiebreaker. So here's my understanding of it. Considering that I'm going to be playing scavenger mode, and I have no idea how difficult it's going to be, I have no idea how easy or hard it's going to be to upgrade my PE abilities, one would think that I should experiment now when I'm playing a mode that I know well. So I know exactly what abilities do what, how effective they are, and what abilities I should take into scavenger mode or leave alone. So, that being all good and said and done, I'm going to go on ahead and upgrade Necrosis to level 3. because I don't know what it would do against the boss, and I'd like to see it, and I've been told that it is absolutely fantastic against the amoebas, and I would like to find that out. Okay, so, Necrosis is now at level 3. Should I even bother to upgrade Pyrokinesis? Probably. Hmm... You know what? This time I might not. This time I think I might focus more on metabolism and healing. Speaking of which, can I upgrade those at all? No, I cannot. I don't have enough PE. Alright, so. Necrosis is now a level 3 ability. I have 85 grenades and 647 rifle rounds. Recovery 3 and NP boost. I have 4 spaces left. I've got a lipstick, a holy water. Cola Recovery 3, Hunter Goggles to prevent me from going blind. Ringer Solution, and MP Boost 2, and a Protein Capsule. Sweet, that's good to know. So I am about as prepared for this boss fight as I can be. So now the trick is... Let me take a look at the map and everything. Dry Field is clean for the moment. That'll change, of course. Now, knowing what we know about what's coming, the boss fight is going to end up destroying that gate on Main Street in the alleyway, which means no more shortcuts through there. And it's also going to destroy part of the balcony here. So the question is, where do I want to end up at the end of the fight? And that depends on where I'm standing when it happens. So... If I end up above my door on the map, I'll have to go through my room to get down to the water tower, through the GNR, blah, 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 down to Main Street. Which would take longer, but would provide me with access to a save point. On the other hand, if I'm near room 5, I can go straight down the stairs, straight through parking, out to Main Street to check on Mr. Douglas. But I'd still have access to the save, so I think what I want is I want to be as close to room 5 as I can get. Either way, though, things will work out just fine, because, hey, we're a hunter. We're, we're, we're a pro. We know what we're doing. No, 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 no. You, you want to take a nap. <laughs> we're pro. I know what I'm doing doesn't press the right button. <laughs> oh, and I do apologize for taking so long in um, making videos. It's um, kind of going through some personal crap, but <laughs> who doesn't, right? <clears throat> no, no. No cutscenes this time. Let's just get straight to it. I might want to get out of the way. I might want to get out of the way. 
You can also shoot it from the alley. Just, just saying, you know. He can't hit you. Alright, first order of business. Antibody. And well timed it was. Second order of business. Energy shot. Okay, that's... really... You don't hit that hard. You really don't hit all that hard. Okay, the fire hurt. Alright, let's see what Necrosis does to your flabby ass. Wow. You guys weren't kidding. This is gonna sting like a bitch. It doesn't last long, but it does. Damn. Wow, dude. Oh no, 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 don't hit me, don't hit me! It does not last long at all, but man. I see what you guys meant. It is face meltingly powerful. Ow. Okay. I think it's time for a ringer solution. No with the fire, no with the fire. Ow! Come on. Alright, so far, so good. This is working out well. That was uncalled for. Alright, quick heal. Okay, look, dude. Do I dare? No, I don't. Oh, that was close. Time for a protein capsule. Wow. I am not gonna lie, folks. That is literally the fastest I have ever beaten this boss. I mean, in all my years of playing this game, I have never beat him this fast. I mean, I know I was prepared and all that, but I was honestly expecting the fight to last a little bit longer. I mean, I didn't know the poison would affect him like an actual physical hit to the point that if he was trying to attack you, he would stop. I mean, you saw how he was about to pick me up, and then the poison hit him, and he was all like, Ow! So, wow. Just, wow. Completely blown away here. Um, oh well, hell, you know me. I will take that ringer solution. That airburst could kiss my ass. So, um, yeah, I'm back at full health. How you doing, game? <laughs> Uh, 15 grenades. That's all it took. 15 grenades. Now, granted, when I first played through... Did I have necrosis? No, I didn't have necrosis. I meant, um... I don't remember if I had energy shot at level 2 or not. I'm fairly certain that I did. Fairly certain. I mean, wow. And he wasn't hitting nearly as hard. The golems were hitting harder than he was. Way harder. Well... We killed the creature, but now it, it, now the place is completely crawling with enemies again. Thankfully, the cellar underpass and waterhole are unaffected, which is good for my peace of mind. So, now that we've defeated Boss Burner, 
We're going to make one more long sweeping pass through. Collect our reward, which we'll probably never use anyway. And then it will be off to disc two, I believe. Yes. <sighs> Where is Kyle? I have no idea. Does it matter? All right, how are we going to do this? I'm going to have to go down to the water tower, through the GNR and parking. Okay, yeah, I know where I'm going. But before that, going in here. Clear up what few enemies there be. Well, easy fight is easy. Did I get back all of my... I think I did. Oh, yeah. Actually, if that's going to be ability I'm going to use more and more for sweep-killing enemies, what do I need to strengthen it? 3,200. I have enough... Ah, it just cuts down the ATP time. It doesn't actually cut down the cost. Well, I could go ahead and upgrade this. I know I prefer to wait until I'm almost out of MP before doing it, but, well, might as well not wait. Why press luck? Why press luck? Why press my fate? Why press my fate? Why am I coming up with these words? Go ahead and report in, let Baldwin know what's going on. Yeah, pretty damn big. Yes, everyone's still at the Aquapolis. Blah, blah, blah. So we're going to make a quick save, but not over the file that we used, of course, naturally. We're not stupid. And by we, I mean me. Okay. <clears throat> now, there's nothing at the water tower, which is a little unusual in and of itself. Right? Yeah, nothing here. But the GNR saloon, that front area is probably... The, the area in front of the GNR is probably going to have golems. Although, if it does have a desert chaser, I will be shocked and amazed. They're clever about their enemy placement, too. Oh, that's a lot of enemies. They're very clever about it. They could have put a golem in here. They could have. But it would have played to my advantage because there's a lot of stuff that a golem to get caught on. I would have been able to maneuver around him pretty easily. Or I could have been caught behind stuff and suddenly found myself at a disadvantage, so... But out here... Out here, I have a chance. Desert Chaser, now there's a shock. Uh, let's end this quickly with an energy shot, huh? Who's a special little boy? You know what, I don't feel like getting poisoned today. Nah, I won't waste grenades. As amusing as it would be to blast him into Kingdom Come. Is that it? No, that's not it. Go ahead and reload real quick. And then, for shits and giggles, I am going to use the grenade pistol. Man, this thing's range is bad. The air burst probably would have been useful here. Yes, it was wasteful. I don't care. <laughs> if you can't have a little fun, then what's the point in even playing game?
It's not all about being serious business. If you can't at least have a little fun with the game, then, well, games just aren't for you, in my opinion. Don't get me wrong, there are some games that are completely serious and demand that you be at least a little bit serious, but... If you can't learn to have a little fun with it... Gentlemen! You know what? Let's try this. Oh, shit. Well, it took a little longer, but <laughs> it worked. Interesting. Not the reaction I would have expected. But the, the true test is going to be when we encounter some amoebas. I don't know when that's going to be. Mr. Douglas, how you doing? Hey guys, you seem to be doing all right. We got the truck key. Truck is ready to go, and we will swing by his place and grab our reward. But first, let's clean up the hotel, cause it's dirty again. Those are scorpions. And I promptly step into the poison. Maybe it'd be a good idea if I unequip the grenade launcher. Maybe then I could do what I need to do without fucking up. It's kind of a difficult concept to understand, I know. I know you wrote it there. Well, that was just plain stupid of me. You try to use poison on an enemy that is poison. You can't use poison on a scorpion. That doesn't work. Logic, Aya. Logic. Use it. I know it's in there. Let's see. How many... How much more is there? All those rooms... Well, I'll have to make a detour through the sewer, just so I can come up through the driveway and cut through the factory. Kind of a long way around, but, um, hey, if it works, it works. I can't reach it, can I? Alright, we're just gonna do one of these. Someone survived. Well. You know, I can't wait to get my hand on... My hand? My hands on the medicine wheel. I could have sworn I was going to get it a lot sooner than this, as a bonus item from a golem fight. I really, really did. But it looks like I'm not going to get it until the normal appointed time. Oh, hi. Ow. Ooh. And then he gets back up just to lean down and start fighting at the floor again. Cause he is all kinds of smart. <sighs> Speaking of golems, I think I'm going to run into some again. Not in here, no, no, I mean like in the back alley. No, you stay away from me.
probably shouldn't have wasted that energy. In hindsight, I, I probably shouldn't have. No, no, I shouldn't have. But like they say, hindsight is twenty twenty. Let's go ahead and get this marked on the map that the door has been smashed. So now we know we can't go through there anymore. Boo hoo. Oh, those golems are still there from where I killed them way back in episode 10. Was it 10? Yeah, it was 10, because that was the pre-boss cleanup. Uh, I'm actually kind of tired of fighting these weaklings. I, I know it's important. I understand that. But when I'm fighting creatures as dangerous and lucrative as... As, wait, I need to go down the center. When I'm fighting creatures as dangerous and lucrative as, as like, the frickin' out golems and such, fighting scorpions just does not do it for me, you know? Do so like this, and just like... Oh, they're on the other side, no wonder I'm not hitting them. Really? That only toasted the one, even though it was clearly in range? Um, Are you lost? I think he was lost. Just saying, I think he was lost. <laughs> Oh, game. You make me laugh. Alright, I'm pretty sure there are golems out here. Oh, that's an unpleasant surprise. You might want to aim at the guy behind you. Okay, I need... Oh dear. Yeah, don't, don't aim at them, dear. Oh, Jesus. No, I don't want to die to these guys, that would be embarrassing. Ugh. That was terrible! I had to use a recovery three, of all things. I was expecting something more dangerous, like a golem fight. Nope. Oh, that was embarrassing. That was all kinds of embarrassing. Well, now at least I have the opportunity to level up plasma, I think. Not yet. What about healing? Not yet. A little more. Is there going to be a golem in here? Oh, I don't know. Find out in a minute. <sighs> Scorpions everywhere. No, I'm not going to waste any MP. I see you over there. Not you. Not you. You. <sighs> I'd like to fight at least one more golem before leaving Dryfield, if possible. That would make me all kinds of happy.
I don't think I'm going to get that lucky, but... Do I really want to make a trip down to the poopy pit again? Yeah, I do, because it is ultimately shorter than going all the way around the GNR saloon and all that crap. Ambush fight! No? This would have been a great time for it, too. Now you'd think just sticking the gun down like that in the water would have some kind of detrimental effect on it. Or maybe she likes the tingling effect, I don't know. Of course, I'm going to be really mad if this somehow got locked. Okay. <laughs> if that got locked, it would be pissed. Hey Kyle, don't know where the fuck you were. Don't know. Don't don't care where the fuck you were. Do not care. Now what's out here? It's kind of interesting that they give him an HP bar in here. Uh. Well, you're in a hurry. Come on. There we go. Whew. That worked. <laughs> that worked way better than the last fight. Of course, in the last fight, there were more of those brain stinger thingies than before. Brain sucklers, I'm sorry. Thank you, Mr. Douglas. How you doing, sir? Can we claim our reward, our M950, which I will never use. I did use it before. In fact, now that I think about it, I did use it during the boss, the final boss fight in the last run, but only because I didn't get the weapon I wanted. Because I didn't go for the quote good ending, so I didn't get the two weapons that I really, really needed. Oops. Okay. I would like, uh, actually none of this, because you haven't had a chance to go to your storeroom. What I would like is some ammunition. Now, there's no point in... When we get to the shelter, we'll be getting buckshot for free. we got 66 grenades. That'll probably see us for the considerable future. In fact, I wouldn't be surprised if I don't have to reload until the final boss fight. And even then, I probably won't use grenades. Unless I get the MM1... That would be fun. But more than all, yeah, that's what I needed more than anything. And again, don't buy don't buy parabellum rounds, you silly if you do. Items. I would like to buy No, no. We're not gonna mess with the pepper sprays anymore. I would like it if I could buy uh flares off of you. That would make me extraordinarily happy. Oh well. What? Background on Kyle, I don't care. Blah, blah, blah. Blah, blah, blah. Okay. Save game, please. Yes, thank you. And then, let's see. 44 is where we were. We're going to save over here. And with that, boys and girls, we're going to call it a video. And next time, we'll make our way to the proper... To the proper? We'll make our way to the shelter... And, uh, well, do what it is we need to do. So until next time, everyone. <laughs>